who is the best candidate uh, for Virtual Tour Pro? Is it a beginner? Is it an expert? Is it? Is it yeah, good question. So we actually do have people from all skill levels that have picked up Virtual Tour Pro and there is something for all of them. With that in mind, I definitely did make it with the intention of taking a beginner who might be discovering virtual tools for the first time and taking them or almost jump-starting them through the process of becoming an intermediate and advanced um, virtual tour professional by really covering every last step of the journey from beginner photography techniques to advanced photography and editing techniques. We cover a lot of the major virtual tour platforms and how to use those really, really well and produce a professional result for your clients. There's a massive business section in the course as well. And that's something I think a lot of the professionals out there aren't doing too well. With all due respect, that's something that is have been, has been a massive value add for my experienced virtual tour pros out there is that they're great photographers, but then they don't understand business. They've got no idea what to do or how to get paying clients. So yeah, absolutely. I, I, I think this is part of that focus on what sometimes we as photographers can obsess on lenses and camera bodies and gear and accessories and tripods and monopods. And uh, uh, I think to your point, uh, all that can be taught of what gear do you need? What platform, what are the platform options? What are the camera options? Uh, and, and it's likely that the most valuable thing in your course is probably helping helping with business development. Yeah, that's right. Honestly, I would consider business to be 51% of the battle, of the journey of being a virtual tour pro. I mean, yes, nice photos are nice, but if you're the world's best virtual tour photographer with no clients, are you really the world's best virtual tour photographer or the most successful? So it really is important. You need both of them to, to be successful, but you, you don't need to get to that super advanced expert level to justify charging for your work. So yeah, absolutely. I think business is just so important and your business techniques and strategies should be considered almost more so than your photographic techniques. Like I said, you need the basics down pat. You need to be able to deliver on what you're promising, but you also need clients to deliver those promises too, to begin with. So yeah, absolutely. I just think business is such an important element of being a, a virtual tour photographer.